Hi guys, I got my little box of whores. And this is what a $100 box would look like if you order the 60 and the 40 together. This is what it would look like. Comes with a, a shirt. Um, how I how I critique the boxes is presentation. Um, do they handle it with care? Do they care about the items that they put in? They like or they have, have a unique spin. They put like something unique spin like that's different from all the other boxes out there. And everyone has their unique spin. Um and I, I don't care about the Id how many items, it's the quality. Do they put quality items in here? Do they send me something that's broken? Is it, you know, usually if it's broken, I benefit of the doubt, usually I think it's the postal service, not the person. But so far, I think my postal service because they handle my items with care. I never get it. I have never, I haven't since got a damaged box with anything that's been damaged. So, knock on wood. I don't know if I moved to Westboro. I don't know how the Postal Service is there. But let's hope that they don't do that either. But so far, my Postal Service has been really good to me. I have luck in that. I just hope if I send boxes out to people, it's not going to do that. So, let's dig in. The theme here is... I am not prepared. Oh, you are not prepared. But Okay. The 30th anniversary in 1987. Which... What about... How about, how about a... How about a... Uh, 36th anniversary of 1981. Hey, well, that my birthday? Hey, hey. That'll be fun. Each birthday. I wonder, yeah, I wonder if, if, if it's good in February. I, and I maybe ask someone to for my birthday gift. Get me a little box of horse for my birthday gift. Ha. And dress it to me and pay. Maybe they can just give me the $40 box. Maybe they can just give me the $40 box. <laughs> they don't have to do it if they're hosting the 60 and like 80, whatever. They don't have to do the $40 box. Dollar box I'll be fine with. Okay, but the 1987 theme. I cheated. I know, I cheat. Also, um, I, I take you know, care. Do they just throw stuff in? You know, well, people just, oh, that goes in there. We're just going to throw that. Oh, this is damn Jimmy D. No, we'll just throw it in there. From, like, if I was going to do a box, think how I would do a box. If I got an item that was cracked, I send it back so I'll get something that's perfect. If I go shopping for it myself, I will look for a DVD that is not cracked and give it like each you know, name so let's dig in I opened the box I always love the t-shirts and lo and behold this is the t-shirt for this month that I ordered for bad taste isn't this an awesome t-shirt I like the t-shirt I don't know if anyone else got theirs and they did um uh, posted on YouTube yet. I don't know if, I don't know from the first one or not or I'm, I'm I don't know. I'm, I don't know who got there. So if you ordered this box Yeah. So if you ordered this box, let me know and give me a link to your video so I can see what you got. I don't know if you guys got the same thing or something different. So this awesome t-shirt, bad taste sad that I will be, I have to wait a while to get it again, but I will, I will, I was very impressed, very impressed. 
I was like, oh, I don't know. I'm like, I'm very impressed. And I got a DVD. Yay. The original Grind. I love Grindhouse. I'm so glad they're actually like paying attention to Grindhouse and they actually would put a Grindhouse film in there, which is lovely. I like that. This is Creepzoids. I've never, I've never watched this. But I've seen it on Full Moon Entertainment and I've seen it around. Um, Leanna Quigley is in this one, which is good because there's so many other films of the 80s and like 70s. Okay, this is synopsis. Your flesh will crawl right off your bones. World War III has turned in the world into a smoking cinder. The year is 1998. <laughs> I was still in high school. <laughs> Six years after nuclear apocalypse, I can never say this right. Nuclear apocalypse, apocalypse, and the fallout, and the fallout continues to plague the survivors with periodic bouts of highly toxic acid rain. A group of ar army desert deserters. Bianca, Leanna Quigley, Kate, Kim McCammy, Butch, Ken Abraham, Jesse, Michael Ar Ar Aranda, and Jake, Richard L. Hawkins. Hmm, how that's, hmm. I don't know how this is going to go over too well. More guys and girls. They take refuge in a seemingly abandoned laboratory complex. I think I've heard this before, and I think I've seen bits and pieces of this. They soon discover that the lab was once a top-secret government research center. Gone away. 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 I can't even pronounce this word right either. All right. Still lurking in its corridors, a hideous, genetically, genetically engineer, engineered monster emerges and mysteriously substance transform one of them into a, another deadly creature. Hmm. Now trapped, the four survivors must destroy the bloodthirsty beast or die in their dripping jaws. I'm guessing from the back of this, I think it, this is the guy who transformed into the ugly beast. It. This guy right there. But gotta love this poster here. Let me take off the plastic. I'm so happy that I got a DVD. Yay! I'm not a, I'm not complaining. Why do people complain? Oh, I didn't get a, a Blu-ray. To me, I don't see the difference between Blu-ray, Blu-ray, and DVD. I pop in a DVD and I pop in a Blu-ray. They look the same. To me, I'm so, oh, I'm so happy for Moon's Grindhouse collection. Oh, my collection Grindhouse is growing. I need more Grindhouse. That's my favorite. Let's see this guy right here. I think that's the guy. But I gotta read. I got a DVD to watch. A film by David Dicotu. Dicotu. Creepazoids. Dicotu. Cryptozoids, your flesh will crawl right off your bones. Flesh can crawl right off your bones. That's awesome. Then, horror hound. I love it to get a magazine. I get to read a magazine. Oh my god, this is awesome. Returns to Columbus, Ohio, November. Th horror hound weekend. Return to Columbus, Ohio, November 3. Through fifth, twenty seventeen, Crown Plaza, Columbus, North One, more than ten, six, six hundred and fifty, sixty five hundred, Double Tree Ave, Columbus, Ohio. So you Ohio, Ohio, oh. so you people in Ohio, um, and Columbus, Ohio, you guys are lucky. They will have Shannon Elizabeth, American Pie, and Jack Frost, T Tara Reed. American Pie and Sharknado. Thomas and Nicholas, American Pie, Halloween Resurrection. 
Mina Savari, American Pie, American Beauty. Is she in a horror? Chris Owen, American Pie, The Mist. Mick Foley, WWE. Oh, Mick Foley. Legend. Yay. Chris Sharanda, Night Before Christmas. Oh, cool. Ken Page, Night Before Christmas. Oh, Zach Galligan, Gremlins and Waxworks. Oh. Robert Brian Wilson, Silent Night, Deadly Night. Awesome. That's cool. Scott McDonald, Jack Frost, Fire in the Sky, John Kaser, 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 I'm sorry, Tales of the Crypt, Ethan Embry, wow, Devil's Candy and Dutch, oh wow, it's been a long time since I've seen Ethan Embry. I remember him way back in the 90s, guys. <laughs> way back. Zach Ward, The Christmas Story. I mean, how is that... How is that horror hound? Was he... I, does he star in... The other stars starred in horror films? I don't know. And uh, Yano Anya, A Christmas Story. Tom Morga, Jason, John Shepard, Tommy Jarvis. Oh, cool. Melanie Kinderman, 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 Pam, and Debbie Sue Voorhees, Tina. Hmm. And John Hawk, Jason. Hmm. School. I mean, cool. This is awesome. I love the cover. I might put this in the flap. It's cool. I like it. It's like old time trick or treater like, and then, and then you have this and that. It's kind of it's cool. And I want this, guys. I want this, and I want this. I'm, I'm so damn dead. Horror Hound. It's only a movie now available. The greatest rock songs in horror movie. History, covered by today's best horror rock punk and punk acts, including The Creep Show, People Are Strange, Dead Dick Hammer, Life at Last, Shadow Wind Hawk, Stigmata Mater, Mr. Monster Looking for Magic, Argyle Goldsby, Save Me Tonight, Psycho Charger, Pet Cemetery. Psycho Charger. Psycho Charger. Charger. For the Wolf. He's back. The Man Behind the Mask. Harley. Harley Poe. That's kind. That sounds cool. Harley Poe. You know, if, I, if my last name was Poe, I'll have. I'll name my daughter. Daughter. Harley. <laughs> Just kidding. Harley Poe. Newborn. The Big Bad. Red. Red Right Hand. The Black Cat Attack. Party time. The Heathens. Burn in Hellraiser. Stellar Corpse. Power of the Night. Oh, it's on record. That's cool. Send me its only movie today. I love these ads. It lights up. Oh my god. Any store. Yes. But someday you will find it. Oh, this is so awesome. Collector Spotlight they have in here. Oh, this is so cool. Letters, letters. Okay, Miranda, George Romero, George Romero, 1940 to 2017, director of Night of the Living Dead, Creep Show, and Martin. John Hurd, 1946 to 2017, actor from the film Cat People, Chud, and the Nurse. Martin Landau, 1928 to 2017, actor. From Ed Wood and North by Northwest, and Haru Haru Nakajima, 1929 to 2017, the actor played Godzilla at 12. What about Toby Hill Cooper? Okay. Okay. Oh, send us your, send us photos of your Halloween costumes. Emailing images with letters to. 
Oh, I might subscribe to this magazine. I might subscribe. Yeah, I might subscribe to this magazine. $6.99. I'll go to whorehound.com and maybe subscribe when maybe you can ask for a subscription to Whorehound. <laughs> My birthday. Birthday is coming up next year. Yeah. Coming up in February. So maybe get a this box asked for my birthday. <laughs> Only forty dollars. First of the month though. No come until March, but the first of the month, like February first. Order it fast. If you want this for me, you have to order it fast. Ah, okay. Well maybe I can ask Maybe I can say, I want this for my birthday. Okay. Oh. Oh, this is cool. This is from the 1970s until it was demolished in 1999. It was one and, and is one with which I had personal connection. Blah, 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 blah. From the 1970s until it was demolished in 1999, and it's one of which I had personal connection. How many people can say they actually have a movie theater in their basement, complete with seats from the actual theater they spent their formative years in? Thanks, Matt Ray. Okay. Hi, Whore Round. Being a huge Clive, Bar Clive, Bar Clive Barker fan. Is it Cleave? Clive? Barker fan. I recently got a portrait tattooed, tattooed, uh, oh yeah, that dude, Peloquin, Peloquin from Nightbreed. The artist was Bob Bieber, Bob Bieber, <laughs> no, sorry, sorry, Bob Bieber from American Skin Art in Buffalo, New York. Thanks, Amy Liz. Mm, thanks. Here's just a few of my horror tattoos. The half sleeves is from Resident Evil. <laughs> okay. And then it has letter from the editor and is okay. These are the contents of my magazine. But <laughs> I am okay. Horror news, indie spotlights, toy news, Halloween, Halloween fun, took a treat. I'm happy for that article. Thirty one haunted days and thirty one thirty one haunts and thirty one days. Artist spotlight, Steve Casino. Someday I will be in this magazine. They'll spotlight me. Artist Steve Casino from Ben Cooper to Retro Go Go. Beyond the Monster Mass, Horrors, Cosplay, Sinister, Bagul, Sinister, Bagul, and Kitley's Crypt, Barbara Steele, Horrors, and Hall of Fame, Halloween 3. Okay. That's the magazine. And then I got the Lost Boys in here. And it's from, um, Rotten Rentals. I was like, I, I have, I, I do, I do have the DVD. I just, I'm hard looking for the um, tape, but I think I can find it on Etsy. And it comes with these little things I got. Gargoyles. Gargoyles. Uh, skeleton Warriors. Oh yeah, the toy things. Six t to the bone cards, premiere edition. Wow. Okay. And I got the Frighteners Deluxe movie cards. Ooh. And Bernie Winston. Oh, this is this is interesting. And last but not least, the Crow. And then I got a zombie tarot card. It's, it's kind of funny. And my tarot is Ten of Wands. Okay, and then I got a little, I think, zombie play thing, a game piece, and vampire teeth. Shall I do the whole thing with this? No. You won't be able to understand me. Not at all. Okay. None with that one. Okay. Sorry, guys. Uh, not sorry, but it's, it's a long video here because I have there's a lot of stuff in here. And then I got a NECA figure, 
And my naked figure is Predator Demon of the Jungle. This is awesome here. Maybe this is what he looks like. There's a big glare. Oh, and the back looks awesome. This is him. But if you see the back of this, this is really awesome. I hope you can see in the back in here. That's really awesome how they did it. I. It says deep in the Central American Central American jungle, the predator is hunting humans for sport. Armed with his plasma caster, wrist blades, and cloaking technology, the predator methodically stalks and kills the opponents he deems worthy. The jungle hunter, predator, collects the skulls and spines of his victims as trophies and, skin his, and skins his prey, leaving the bodies hanging from the trees. When a special force team is dispatched on a rescue mission, they soon become the predator's prey. Features removable backpack and now over 30 points of articulation. And these are all the people you can, all the characters you can get. I got Predator, so I should watch the movie. I haven't watched Predator. Okay. This is cool here. This little print thing. This is awesome. I don't know if it's done by the person or it's actually hmm. approved by the Comic Code Authority. The Monster Scarred. March 4th. Also in this issue, the Wolfman has Nards. <sighs> Dracula lives again. Oh, this is this is cool. This is cool. Oh, it's flipping. That's cool. I'll hang that up. Hang that up. And then I got this. Necromantic. I've seen this on um, YouTube. I haven't seen it, but I should. I should. Look at this eye. Oh, it's like a... Yeah. Oh. And there's a little box of horrors exclusive, a limited edition, 24 out of 100. Cool. That's cool. I like it. I'm going to hang it up. Oh, kind of reminds me in um, which one? I think it's part two, or one or three of Friday the Thirteenth, where the crazy person. It was a crazy bum. I think it was the second or third one, where this crazy bum guy comes out and goes, like, starting crazy, like you were the eyeball from a dead person. It's cool. Mine is, yep, 24 out of 100. So 100 people. It's 100 for 100 people. Oh. And I got a pen, which is really cool. I like this pen. When the curtains go up, the terror begins. Good to the last grasp. Proudly presented by Roadshow Home Video. This is cool. The Masters of Macro Bay, Stephen King, George A. Romero welcomes you to Creep Show 2. Mature audiences. This is awesome. Creep Show 2. Young Billy rushes to the local store, hopeful to pick up the latest issue of his favorite. Oh, this is British. Because it's how they spell favorite. Of his favorite horror comic. Creep Show, as it expected, his Creep Show. As expected, his old friend Creepshow. Okay. As expected, his old friend the Creep shows up, and before before long, Billy is launched into a three all new tales of terror and suspense. Be sure not to miss out on your copy. Approximate runtime features 92 minutes plus trailers. The monster and horror Stephen King and George Romero bring you all new tales of terror. To Scare you lifeless. Creep Show 2 is a trashy, irresistible, fun from King and Romero. Gross point news. Horror fan films will have a ball. Regular Roger Hubert. Hurlbert. 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 Hubert. Hurlbert. <laughs> okay. Entertainment. Oh, wow. This is cool how they, they got the pin and did this. Oh, that's cool. In the back, there's a thing in the back. This is the pin. I think maybe everyone got this pin. That's cool. Oh, 
Then I got Lost Boys Comics, which I am happy. This is Lost Boys Harris Harris cover, and this is just from this from last year's years. Vertigo Comics three ninety nine. Awesome. It's awesome. You gotta love the Lost Boys. And then I got a little trick or treat thing. And it says my name on it, which I like. Happy Halloween. That's awesome. I like that. Got was oh it is on the thing. And I got an eyeball to eat. Product of China. <laughs> Candy, gummy body part, gummy candy body parts, an eyeball. I got a troll sour bites, trolly. Oh, Halloween, love it. Oh, it's a golden dark skeleton. I hope it is. I think it is, but awesome is it? Oh, is it? It's an alien skeleton or something, but I love it. Thank you for that one. And then I got, oh yeah, you fill it up. With, I've seen this. Fill it up with this liquid thing and you put it in the teeth. So I got like, and this looks like it glows in the dark. This, this is cool. It smells good. I got two vampire teeth. This is awesome. And then I got it. Wild Bay Skittles. Love that. Oh, I hope. And I got Smarties. Yay. And Super Bubble Bubble Gum. Okay, which one I'm going to eat? I think I'm just going to eat Super Bubble Bubble Gum. Oh, it's green. What flavor is this? Yeah. What flavor? Mmm. I don't understand. But, what flavor do you do? This is Joe, over and out. Bye bye, my sick things. <laughs> Goodbye, Rangoon. Bye.